This next short video is what you've been waiting for. This actually is kind of where the rubber meets the road. What it does is demonstrates the use of traditional cutting tools that we use to remove cervical stenosis, to remove the bone spurs that are pinching the spinal cord, versus the use of a new what's called ultrasonic tool that uses high-speed vibration that also removes the bone spurs can be used in a much smaller space actually from the inside out and we can take out the stenosis without taking out the important structures that actually hold the head up so we can avoid fusions we can do procedures that maintain function and mobility and ultimately lifestyle so this is a example of a traditional cutting tool that spins fast it tears and it essentially rips out the bone when it's used next to something delicate it's actually quite dangerous Compared with an ultrasonic tool that uses vibration, there's no sharp edges, and it can be used in very small spaces. It's much more powerful, it cuts through bone much more effectively than a traditional tool, but used on something delicate like a balloon or next to a nerve, it's quite safe. If you know how to use this, it's actually quite difficult to pop that balloon. Using it next to something delicate like a, a piece of, of tissue, it also won't damage it. But when I work inside a spine, and this is a, an example of working inside a model with a balloon, with a balloon on the inside. And what this tool can actually do is it can work inside the bone, directly in contact with the balloon, directly in contact with the nerves, remove the bone spurs, remove the stenosis, but not damage the nerves. This is a traditional tool trying to do the same thing clearly the process is much different. So what the new tool allows us to do is treat stenosis from the inside out. We're able to remove the bad stuff and save the good stuff. And functionally, that creates a completely different paradigm in the way we can fix your problem.